there is evidence that many galaxies possess gigantic black holes at their centers, including our own Milky Way galaxy. There are estimates that put the black hole at the center of our Milky Way galaxy at 4.3 million solar masses, or 4.3 million times more massive than the Sun. Yet, there are far more massive black holes, such as Ton 618, which is over 18 billion light years away, with a mass of 66 billion solar masses, according to NASA. If one of these supermassive black holes is particularly bright due to an accretion disk, it is typically called a quasar. Quasars can develop an accretion disk with so much energy that it can shine hundreds of trillions of times brighter than our sun. Additionally, they also produce very powerful jet streams of hot gas that are launched out above and below its axis of rotation. These jet streams can be so powerful as to launch out hundreds of thousands of light years into space. There are multiple mechanisms that contribute to the production of these jets. The accretion disk spinning near the hole expands out and thickens due to the enormous pressure from the high heat which guides the gases through narrow tunnels along the axis of rotation. There are also magnetic field lines from the accretion disk that are trapped within the center of the disk and their rotation guides plasma up and down along the jet streams. There can also be a cooler cloud of gas surrounding the hotter accretion disk. The cooler gas cloud blows up like a bubble due to the hotter gases from the spinning accretion disk. This bubble inflates, but holes in the top and bottom form to expel the hotter gases out.